We begin today with new developments on the recent state bill requiring all classrooms to hang the Ten Commandments in site on, on campuses. News 10's Dawson D'Amico joins us now in studio with how a recent federal judge ruled the law as unconstitutional. Today, United States federal judge John DeGravels issued his order and ruling against the display of the Ten Commandments in a 177 page document. DeGravels said the law created is facially unconstitutional in all applications. He says all defendants in the suit are prohibited from enforcing the law and making rules requiring religious text be hung in all public school classrooms. You know, I, I can easily see the direction that the uh, that the judge took in this case and that they were following a, a long line of precedent in the area of Establishment Clause cases around Ten Commandments and displays in uh, public schools. Louisiana Governor Jeff Landry signed House Bill 71 on June 19th requiring all classrooms to hang posters of the Ten Commandments in large legible print, citing its historical significance independent of religious values. David Hughes is an associate political science professor at UL Lafayette who says even though the historical aspect was stated as the reason, displaying the commandments shows a religious preference which is prohibited under the Establishment Clause with the First Amendment and religion. You know, I assume that's the direction this case would take, was that plaintiffs would claim by uh, displaying the Ten Commandments A in uh, classrooms with children is overly coercive, um, and, and, and that, that B, by picking the Ten Commandments, uh, government is, is, is playing favorites here, which is also frequently uh, not allowed under the Establishment Clause. Hughes talks about how a change in the Supreme Court about Establishment Clauses over the years keeps the future of the ruling in question. Because the Supreme Court has so changed direction in recent years, I'm not entirely sure where this goes on appeal. Louisiana Attorney General Liz Merle sent out a statement on the Ten Commandments law saying, quote, We strongly disagree with the court's decision and will immediately appeal as House Bill 71's implementation deadline is approaching on January 1st, 2025. This decision only binds five of Louisiana's many school boards. This is far from over, end quote. The governor's office, BESE, and the Louisiana Department of Education said they have no comment. Dawson D'Amico, KLFY News 10.